Hi everybody, my name's Lee, and I know a lot of you from RE for the last few years I've been working in the nursery, and now I'm in Bethany's position um, as the director of the program. So I'm excited to be offering these um, little videos every week, and um, we'll either have a story or a meditation, um, and always a song, because I really like singing, so I'm going to teach you a song every week. So today we have um, our theme of water and renewal. Um, so I have a bowl of water here with me um, and we're going to learn a song to sing to the water and also do a really fun um, little activity that involves bubbles. So um, I hope you enjoy this first video of RE. Um, and the first thing that I wanted to say is inviting you to take some time this week to either get a bowl of water like this or if you can go down to a pond or a stream or even the ocean and just sit with um, sit with the water and think about how important that water is in our lives right because obviously we can't survive very long without drinking water and then think about when it's so hot outside and you're sticky and drippy and muggy and hot and how amazing it feels to jump in a body of water to be able to swim and cool down and cleanse yourself and feel refreshed and new so that feeling is the focus of this month is feeling refreshed and new and kind of beginning again together as we begin this new year of RE and and, and really coming together and, and forming our connections again, even if we're apart. Because those connections are super important, even if we can't see each other in person. So I'm really excited to be part of this year with you. Um, and here is our song for the water. And just to say first, there's one word in here that you get to choose. So when I sing it this time, I'm gonna choose the word love. But when you sing it, you can choose any word you want um, as something that you want to send down to the sea, to the ocean, and send off into the world to circulate around the world with all the waters of the world. So listen for the word love, and then when you sing it, you can choose your own word. So here's the song. Oh, let the water run down clear and carry my love to the sea oh let the water run on down and carry me home so think about what you want to send to the sea and it might be something lovely and wonderful like joy or laughter or playfulness or cuddles and it might be something that you might be having a hard time with, like feeling sad or feeling frustrated or feeling bored. And the thing about water is that it can cleanse away any of those things that we're feeling kind of done with. So if you want to send something that's a little hard for you to the sea, um, that ocean will cleanse it and take it and transform it. So send your blessings and your love and um, just take a moment to sit with water sometime this week. And now we have a really cool little experiment. Um, so take your bowl of water, take a little bit of dish soap. So I have this nice biodegradable dish soap and you don't need very much. So you're going to take just like that much, just a little tiny squirt into your bowl of water, and then find a straw. And instead of using the straw to suck up the water, because that would be gross, the soapy water is not gonna taste good, we're gonna very gently blow into the bowl of water. And make sure your bowl is not super full. Um, mine's just half full of water right here. So let's see what happens.
that amazing? I, when I first did this, I didn't know how beautiful it was going to be. So I hope that you take a, a minute to do this at home because it makes these interconnected bubbles that are all pressed together in like perfect hexagon shapes where their edges meet. They make these like beautiful rainbow, almost like prisms. And I thought this was an amazing metaphor for our congregation and for our community um, and even for your family, for all the groups of people that you belong to, you are connected to all of them, just like these bubbles. And you grow and you shift and you change and some of the bubbles are, they come and they go, but they're all still connected together, just like all the water of the world. So um, I hope that you can do this and just feel the connection of our community um, all surrounding you, just like these bubbles are all connected together. And I hope that um, you can join us for our Sunday Zoom meeting um, to share roses, buds, and thorns and sing some more songs. Um, and if not, I'll uh, see you again next week for another video. And I hope you have a wonderful week and enjoy that water. Bye.